Finally tonight, a woman on the fast track in the sport of auto racing, which has, let's face it, been dominated by many of the same faces over the years, but that's changing, which is why Nicole Lyons has been named one of this year's 100 most notable people, as chosen by our partner website for African American news and culture, thegrio.com. NBC's Rahima Ellis caught up with Nicole Lyons in Atlanta. Let's take you into my world, my office. Nicole Lyons may not look the part, but this 5'6", 110-pound woman is an up-and-coming contender in car racing. In a million-dollar car, she barrels down a quarter-mile track at 250 miles per hour in just over five seconds. So you can't blink or sneeze at one of our races because it's, it's over with. She stands out in this sport that is one of the fastest in the world. In top sportsman drag racing, Nicole is the only woman and the first African-American woman. The driving force behind her love of cars and racing was her father, a drag racer himself. Since five years old, I've been passing wrenches to my dad. Before his death, he taught her everything he knew about cars, including what's under the hood. Now 29 and married, she owns a muscle car restoration shop near Los Angeles, where most of her mechanics are women. Being one of a kind and with model looks, she's attracted attention. I think it's lucrative for our sponsors and our marketing partners to have somebody that diverse. Um, in the sport who can really pioneer and really show other people um, minority wise that they can do this. Now Nicole is training to compete in NASCAR. A longtime trainer believes she's unstoppable. They're not going to tell her she can't do it, so she's just going to keep going. So I don't think there is a limit. Nicole says she thrives on testing limits. It's like that, that old saying, if it's too hot, you know, you need to get out the kitchen. And uh, right now I like the burn. One young woman gaining respect in a man's world. This car has a little power. And proving she's on the right track. Too much speed for me. Rahima Ellis, NBC News, Atlanta.